Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. London on Earth. What's his condition? About to complete Mass Effect 3. This is the, the final mission, Priority Earth. Let's continue. Ah, oh, it's Javik. Commander. Was it this bad in your time? Worse. I have been listening to the Krogan speak to his men. In our cycle, the races never came together. There was no rallying cry. I envy you. Really? There's not much left out there. The future is still out there. It is something my people could never say. There will be a tomorrow. Only if we win today. No one else has ever made it this far. You did. You came a long way, Javik. Further than anyone else here. And I look forward to fulfilling my mission. But you are now the avatar of this cycle. The exemplar of victory. Not just for humanity, or Turians, or Protheans, but for all life. Every soul that has ever existed is watching this moment. Well, no pressure to put it that way. Do not waver. Victory is never won without difficult choices. So I've learned. I know. I've had to make a lot of those. There may be more. But I know you will see this through for all of us. No matter the cost. If we actually pull this off, what'll you do afterwards? Since my birth, life's only pursuit has been war. I look forward to seeing what peace looks like. It's a big galaxy. I believe the Hanar would welcome me. I could live like a king among them. Thank you, Commander, for letting the last voice of the Protheans speak. It has been a privilege. All right, two more reputation. And here is one of our favorite Krogan. Shepard, you did it. No matter what else happens today, you united a galaxy. That's a victory right there. Nobody leaves the battlefield with an empty clip. Give the Reapers everything you've got. All right. Somebody go see if the Quarians have anything to eat. All that Turian food gave me the runs. What about this? We could circle around and flood it with reinforcements. Okay, we have a few more goodbyes. And a data pad. No credits, though. Name me one I guess we don't need them at that point, but experience would be nice. It's Admiral Ron. Commander Shepard, a pleasure to see you again. I appreciate your support, Admiral. Those live ships will bring a lot of firepower. Just keep them protected. The live ships are safe, Commander. But we'll do whatever we must to win. Thanks, Ron. Good luck. I don't think she was in the unmodded game either. Who else have we got? I don't want to miss anybody. Oh my goodness, we get to talk to a Geth Prime. Shepard, Commander. What's your status? The Gath are prepared to face the Reapers. We have coordinated with Creator Forces. Our platforms will support their ground units. Additional platforms will arrive via orbital drop once clearance is achieved. Preparations are complete. We stand ready. You would think, with all these people, all these races, that we could, con we could beat them conventionally. Oh wow, we got sniping going on here? Almost time for the final push. Are you okay? I thought I'd be asking you that question. Shepard, 
I backed you when I was just a kid on her pilgrimage. I backed you when the Normandy was a Cerberus ship. What kind of friend would I be if I didn't back you now? And you haven't answered my question. Are you okay? Mm. Seeing Earth like this hurts. You remember how you felt when you landed on Rana? Now imagine it's not a story passed down by your people. Imagine you were there just a few months ago. And now you're seeing it like this. We need to put it right. We will. Whatever happens, I'm proud to have served with you, Captain. Hmm. Likewise. It's been an honor, Ali Zorabas Normandy. The Admirals once hung that ship name on me like a badge of shame. And then the Normandy helped us reclaim our homeworld. It's time I returned the favor. Hmm. All right. Two more reputation. Okay, let's talk to Edie. We're getting down here to the the end of our discussions. Edie? Shepard, I have a question. Is it a big or small one? It is important. Its relevance would be diminished at any other time. Ask away. In this battle, the Reapers have no reason not to use their full capabilities to destroy us. Their forces are in entrenched positions. They have superior firepower and outnumber our forces. My question is, what makes you think we can reach the Conduit at all? Hmm. They underestimate us. The Reapers have the Citadel. They think they've won, and that's the best time to hit them. If they have spies or other intelligence, we could lose the element of surprise. In such a case, we will likely lose. Are you afraid? Our probability for success is greater than any other plan presented to date. That's not what I asked. Are you afraid? I do not understand the purpose of the question. There's no room for doubt anymore, Edie. You understand what we have to do, or you don't. I am clear on what we must accomplish, Shepard. The Reapers have destroyed thousands of civilizations. But they have never destroyed ours. Nor will they. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Couldn't have put it better myself. Time to move out. Shepard, there is something I want you to know. The elusive man ordered my creation years ago. Jeff was the one who allowed me to think for myself. But only now do I feel alive. That is your influence. Thanks, Edie. Yeah. Thanks. Okay, what's this little globe over here? An Earth hologram. Alright, this is new. A hologram of Earth that shows the location of active hammer forces and their targeted cities. Rio, London, Vancouver, Shanghai, and New York. Ground teams in New York and Vancouver are reporting heavy casualties, but have established a beachhead. However, casualties in Rio are too heavy to mount an effective offensive. All surviving forces in Rio are being rerouted and requesting immediate reinforcements. Hammer forces in Shanghai are being severely hampered by collector seeker swarms, but are slowly pushing towards their objective. Command is tentatively discussing the nuclear option, sacrificing the major cities with heavy bombardment to make up for lost ground. Let's look closer. Wow, are you kidding me? <laughs> That's a nice touch. All right, let's talk to Admiral Anderson. Commander, Admiral, just going over the Citadel. How's it look? Less than 40% of Hammer has reported in. Tell me there's more coming. There's some stragglers still en route. But the bulk of Hammer that's still intact has arrived. We're as ready as we're likely to get. All right, well, let's start the attack. Well, oh, wait, wait, what is almost ready? Does that get me to do a rallying speech? I'm almost ready. 
I'll check on my team. We'll get going soon. I'll give the battalion leaders the heads up. We'll be ready as soon as you are. Okay, so we've already talked to our team. So let's let him know that we are ready. Whenever you're ready. Start the attack. Let's move before the Reapers realize what we're up to. Exactly my thoughts. Battalion leaders, report to HQ. We fought hard to get here. But now the toughest part of our mission begins. We've got to drive right through the heart of Reaper-controlled territory, break past their defenses, and get to that beam. What kind of defenses? The entire area is crawling with Reaper forces. But our biggest concern is the destroyer, protecting the beam itself. Can we bring in air support to deal with it? Negative. Some kind of interference. We'll have to take it out from the ground. Now they've cut a swath of no man's land through the city. We'll have to cross that first. There'll be some limited shelter on the other side, but expect heavy ground resistance. We need to get our tanks to here. If we get close enough, we've got a shot at taking that thing out. We'll rendezvous here and plan our final assault. Questions? How much of a shot? They know we're coming. This will be a one-way trip for many of us, but there can be no retreat, no stepping back. We move forward at all costs, understood? Hoorah! 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 Yes, sir. yes, sir! Johnson, Coates, you two will coordinate the artillery units. Shepard, I'm sending you right up the gut where the resistance is heaviest. Support the tanks the best you can, but stay alive. I need you for the final push through the beam. I'll give you a minute with your squad. Pick your team well. Comrades. This war has brought us pain and suffering and loss. But it's also brought us together as soldiers, allies, friends. This bond that ties us together is something the Reapers will never understand. It's more powerful than any weapon, stronger than any ship. It can't be taken or destroyed. Remember what you fight for. The next few hours will decide the fate of everyone in the galaxy. Every mother, every son, every unborn child. They're trusting you, depending on you to win them their future. A future free from the threat of the Reapers. Be fearless. But take heart. Look around you. You're not in this fight alone. We face our enemy together. And together, we will defeat them. the critical choice. Hmm. Well, I hope I don't regret this. I'm going to take Edie and Ash. I, I really want to take James with the, the incendiary ammo. But she gives us disruptor ammo and we're going to be faced with a lot of shielded enemies. I think I can work with that. Let's go. And I certainly need Edie to debuff the shields with her overload. Okay, so here's our weapons. It's good. I think we'll keep Ash with her same set of weapons. Um, yeah, I guess Edie can have this. Let's 
Let's go. You two, with me. The rest of you, good luck. Scenes that they pulled from looked like multiplayer footage. It's amazing. here and when we come back it is going to be all out war this is hell and I'm out.